research is really just an opportunity for students to go one step beyond the classroom. Doing research can enhance your academics in a way that no class can. It's one of the best ways to separate yourself from all of the other people around the United States that are doing the same major as you would be doing. And you're able to take your specific interest and kind of mold that into your own individual project. You can learn the facts and the theories and the protocols, but until you actually go out and get your hands dirty, you don't know what it's like to actually work in the field. It gives you the ability to really um, put what you've learned to use. While I was here, I did research on snapping turtle immune health. So what the project entailed was having to take blood samples from snapping turtles, and catching snapping turtles is a lot more difficult than I would have imagined. What I found was that one of the newer methods of measuring stress in animals doesn't work for snapping turtles. I had to set up nets, and I had to try different kinds of bait all through the summer to try to figure out which ones would attract the snapping turtles the best. And then the hardest part was actually getting the turtles out of the net and getting their blood without getting bit. When you come into college, you usually have ideas about where you want to end up, and you use those ideas to base what classes you're going to take and what courses of academics you want to go through. Uh, but until you actually put your hands into what you think you want to do, you don't know whether or not you're going to like it. Um, for example, I really wanted to go to medical school before I started doing research, and once I got into the research, I realized that research is actually where I want to go. So I changed my mind at the last minute and decided I wasn't going to apply to medical school anymore. I wanted to go to graduate school so that I could do research. During my time here, I had the opportunity to be involved in several undergraduate research projects. One was involving hydraulic fracturing, which is a method of natural gas extraction and its effect on amphibian development. And the second project was involving mineral transport in riparian corridors, which are areas along stream beds, and how that affects the community composition of local amphibians. The most exciting part of my research in particular was the results. So we spent an entire summer testing a hypothesis and going out, gathering field data, doing all these difficult statistics to find that what we had initially thought was going on was actually correct. For my research, um, I got to participate in an opportunity through WISE to be, to be the UVA WISE Global Health Scholar, which gave me the opportunity to travel to South Africa with a group of medical, nursing, and graduate students from UVA. And I was able to work with the project to develop a training program for diabetes and hypertension in an underserved region in South Africa. It was just a really powerful thing to, you know, meet these people who live thousands of miles away in a completely different environment and completely different world and just be able to make a difference in someone else's life and be able to complete research that really has an impact on a community and even as an undergraduate I had that opportunity. Undergraduate research isn't just limited to sciences and biology and that sort of thing. You have any discipline, any subject, you can do some form of research in, whether it be examining a paper in English or psychology. And even within biology, if you're not interested in going out in the field and collecting things, you can do a molecular project. You can get involved in the lab with the lab coats and all the things that you would normally see um, on stuff like CSI, getting, getting hands-on experience with stuff like that, that are, that's inside the lab. For me, if I didn't do research, I may not have realized that I had such an interest in medicine. So it's a really great way for a student to kind of take something they're interested in and run with that. And I would absolutely recommend it. It's a great experience. Doing research helped me figure out what I want to do with my life and what I want my career to be. And it gave me a better start for when I go to graduate school because I know what I like and what I don't like and I know that I have the ability to do research. The first step to doing undergraduate research would be speaking to your advisor, whether it's your freshman advisor or your major advisor. Um, go talk to them about doing undergraduate research and to take it a step further you should come up with an idea first, something that you're passionate about, whether it be examining your favorite author if you're an English person or an answering some sort of scientific question. Um, just look at something you're passionate about and then bring it to your advisor and tell them, hey, I'm interested in doing research on this topic.